Hey guys, I'm Savvy, and welcome back to another episode of Paper Mario. In the last episode, we began the game by watching Bowser take this star rod, this very special, uh, well, it gives him special powers, but also this object that's called the star rod, and it gave him unbelievable powers. And we try to face him in Peach's castle because for some reason, with nobody knowing, he had an entire fortress underneath the underneath the castle and we went up into the sky we tried to fight him but it didn't work because the star rod gave him invincibility so uh we lost and we fell from the sky and now we ended up here um in toad village or goomba village excuse me not toad village goomba village which is west of toad town anyway so um yeah so in this episode we're going to continue through because this is my first ever playthrough of this game and i'm gonna get lost pretty quick i'm sure Please feel free to come here anytime you get tired. A good nap will work wonders when you're feeling weak. I think that's a hint to, like, if my health is low, I can take a nap. Alright, well, here we are. Goomba Village. Alright, let's talk to everybody. Oh, land sakes, Mario. So nice to meet you. My, I'm so glad you woke up. I can't tell you how worried I was when you were just lying there asleep for so long. Hey Mario, I'm Goombario. I'm your biggest fan. You don't know what this means for me to meet you, seriously. Oh, that's nice. Mario, you look better. I'm so glad. I was really worried about you because you were lying there in the fortress and you didn't open your eyes at all the whole time. Yeah, I'm glad I'm okay. What's in here? Oh, hello. Oh, Mario. Hello, dearie. You may call me Goomba. I'm a Goomba grandmother, so that's where I got the name. Ho, 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 ho. Have you already met my lovely grandchildren? Aren't they sweet? Especially little Goombaria. Why, she looks just like I did when I was young. Ho 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 ho. That's sweet. Wow, that's a big place. Uh, is this a storage space back here? Oh no, it's a balcony. Hello. Oh. Oh, you startled me. Mm, yes, Mario, isn't it? So you've awakened at last. Good. I knew you'd pulled through. Call me Goompa. I'm the Goomba grandfather, so I'm Goompa. I'm sorry, but would you mind giving me the details later? I'm pretty busy fixing the veranda. Alright, well, let's get out of here then. Made our introductions, I guess, to everybody. Oh, here's a save! You know, I probably should have done that last episode, because I had to go through the cutscene again. <laughs> but that's okay. Yes, I would like to save. Perfect. Alright, oh, hello. Howdy, Mario! Feeling better? Feel free to rest in your in our house. It's such a shabby place. It may look a little unkempt at the moment, but I'm fixing all the earthquake damage. In fact, I just spent ages fixing this gate. You what? You have to leave right now? Oh, Shooting Star Summit. Something important, no doubt. Well, I believe that the summit is near Toad Town. If you take this, if you take this road straight ahead, you'll eventually reach Toad Town, the home of Princess Peach's castle. I believe that Shooting Star Summit is just beyond there. It's too bad you can't stay. I feel like I just met you, but duty calls, I know. Come back and visit if you can. Best of luck, Mario. Hee yee yee! Oh no. What do you want? Oh gosh. <laughs> ah, my instincts were right. Mario, I can't believe you're on your feet after taking such a beating from King Bowser. You're hardly- you're a hardy one, all right. I was smart to come here to check on you. What? What? What's that, Daddy? What's that weird flying thing? Weird? You rude little- I'm a beautiful Koopa with a beautiful name, Cabby Koopa. Hm. I wish I had the time to teach you a lesson, brat, but no. Mario, hear this! It is useless for you to try to save Princess Peach. Ridiculous. Laughable. As you have seen, King Bowser is more powerful than even you could deal with this time. Here's a gift from him. Oh, hello. Oh, you broke the gate! <laughs> Mario, you will kneel and weep when you see the wonderful changes King Bowser's made. Your world is ours now. <laughs> Get out of here, Cammy. Um, I just fixed that gate. Nobody say gate to me. Cammy Koopa, that fiend. Did you hear what she said about the princess? 
It didn't sound good. I hope nothing's happened to her. What? 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 Bowser went and kidnapped Princess Peach? Again? Oh, unbelievable. And now you gotta... <laughs> now you have to go to Shooting Star Summit and help save her, right? Um, this could be a problem. Dad, we just gotta do something, right? Mario's gotta save the princess. Nobody else can do it. Um... Oh, here's an idea. Maybe we can break this block with Goomba's big hammer. I think he's using it right now to fix the veranda. Go ask him for it, will you? I oh, might not like the fact that I'm gonna take his hammer away, but we'll see. Hope you guys are liking the voices I give these characters, because, I mean, there's gonna be a lot of people we're talking to, so I'm gonna give a lot of voice. Oh. Um. Uh-oh. Well, the veranda just broke. Oh. oh. <laughs> what the heck? Well, it looks like he... Oh, hello. Oh, my. Back? Hmm? Who's that? That you, Mario? I remember a great crashing noise, and then the veranda collapsed, and I fell. Did you fall, too? Just stepped out the door into thin air, did you? Well, you're both okay. Problem is, we can't get home because that block is in the way. Oh, this isn't the block? This block. This block shouldn't be here. Well, this is a problem for us. Us. <laughs> huh? A hammer? Of course! Um, where did it go? I was using it to fix the veranda, so it's likely around here somewhere. Hm. Nowhere to be seen. I guess it must have fallen somewhere over there. Mario, we better look for it. Also, the voices that I give might not be 100% accurate every time when I talk to them again, because the amount of voices I do... <laughs> it's a bit... <laughs> There's gonna be a lot that we're doing, and yeah, it's gonna be... I might forget from time to time. Um, It's around here somewhere. Is it this way? No, I can't go that way. Oh, I have to go this way. Doi. The hammer's got to be somewhere close by. It looks just like this. Look for the bushes that might cover it up. If exclamation appears over your head, you can press A to search. Alright, there's a save here. Ah. Oh, a coin. Nothing there. Oh. Oh, I found it! You found the hammer! Mario can do the hammer attack now. You can smash a yellow block with this hammer. Oh, there we go! That's it! That's the hammer! I'll wager that if you use that hammer, you can break the block that's in our way. You can also use the hammer to hit trees and make them sway. Sometimes stuff will fall out. You can use it by pressing B. Sounds good. Oh, like that. Yep. Another coin. I definitely want to check everywhere here. I am not going to... Okay, I can't do anything with that. Another coin... Coins are very important because we'll use this to buy things at the stores. Because I know about Paper Mario and the Thousand Year Door, and I know that you need money to buy items, so we're definitely going to be doing that. Oh, that didn't have anything in it. What about this? Nothing there. There's also a floating block here. Nothing. What about this one? Nothing. Alright. Well, that sucks. I was hoping there would be more than that, but oh well. Oh. Hmm. Well, we found the hammer, so I guess we should head for, head for home. Ouch! Uh-oh. Who are you? Who are you guys? This is my playground, idiots. Nobody sets foot in here without my permission. Nobody. Prepare to start crying at the feet of Master Junior Koopa. Or Troopa. Did I say Koopa or Troopa? <laughs> my bad. Mario, this is Junior Troopa. Troopa. This is Junior Troopa. He's the boss of the neighborhood gang. A bit of a bully, obviously. He's more bark than bite. You can beat him easily. Just boost yourself up and don't take any lip. I'll stay right here behind you and watch your progress. Alright, let's use our hammer. Like that. Oh, excellent. Good move. Go on. Oh, ouchie. Alright, we're gonna use the hammer again. Hmm. Use it again. Gah! I'm just getting warmed up. Ouchie. You know what? I'm gonna jump on you. 
Mario, you almost got him. Keep it up. Go on. All right, you asked for it. Say hello to Junior Troopa's special attack. Full power. Uh-oh. Ow. Oh, we're low. Oh, we did it. Nice. Mario, that was wonderful fighting. You got star points. You get star points every time you beat an enemy. Every time you save up 100 star points, you'll go up a level. Always try hard to get points. We got 20 star points. Awesome. Shoot! I was winning too! I'll be back, Mario! I mean it. I'll be back. All right. Yeah, I'm sure we'll, that he's not the first. It's not the first time we're gonna see him. All right, let's see here. Coin. Awesome. And we can destroy this block here. And health. Yeah, we definitely need health after that. All right, so let's get up here. Break that. Nothing there. What's up here? Does this take us back up to the top? Oh. Oh, cool. <gasps> Our first item. You got the Fire Flower, a flower that burns all enemies with fireballs. Attack power 3. You got an item. You use items in this game to attack enemies to recover your HP, heart points, and do a few other things. Press the left uh, <laughs> left on the D-pad to see what items Mario has now. Also, if you guys are wondering, I'm still using, even though this is an N64 game, much like with my other games that I've played, um, this... I'm using a PS4 controller. <laughs> it still works. It works just fine. I mean, with a game like this, with it being turn-based, it's totally fine. Heads up, Mario. I see bad Goombas ahead. They're loyal to Bowser. If they see you, they'll attack you without hesitation. You can, if you can successfully attack an enemy in the field with a jump or hammer, you'll get the first strike when you enter the battle. Striking first really helps when it comes to battling. Oh, that's good. Also, I'm sorry for the, the border on the game, uh, the way that the resolution is in this game is, uh, it's very small, and especially with Project 64, it's, yeah, I might have to extend the size of it a little bit, and I might do that for next episode, but for now you're gonna see that black border around, because even when I play, there's still the black border that's around it too, so I hope you guys are okay with that, uh, at least for this episode, but I'll fix it in the next one. And I know for this one, if I get the first hit, then I think they take damage. They take damage when we begin, so. Ouch. Dig that. Yay! Alright, so I might try to get... There we go, like that. You made the first strike. Yep. This is a spike Goomba. See the spike on his head? Be careful not to jump on him. You'll definitely get hurt. Yeah, so I'm not going to do any jump attacks because since he has a spike on his head, it'll hurt my feet and I'll take damage. All right. Oh, Paragoomba. Ah, there you go. Take that. And by doing damage to them, they lose their wings. Listen up, Mario. The enemy's flying. Your hammer won't reach the enemies in the air. To attack airborne enemies, use to use a jump attack. You can jump over one enemy to attack one behind it, too. This is a good advice to remember. <laughs> Alright, you're gone. I think there's a way where I can eventually block. I I'm sure it'll tell me that in the tutorial as we're going along here, so... Jump. Yeah, since these are beginner enemies, they have very little health. And soon enough, we're going to be able to level up once. There was also, like, a shard I saw nearby, so we're going this direction to be able to get it. Because I definitely want it! Alright. Ooh, a health point. Thank you. Sorry, you got to Oh, I was going to say stuck there. What's this? You got the star piece. It's a glowing star piece. Wait and see what this is for. Okay. That's it? Just I just got to wait and see? All right. Whatever. <laughs> well, that's a collectible, I guess. All right. I think we're getting close to heading back to Goomba Village. 
Never worry, kids. Here I am. Thank oh, we're, we're here already. Thanks to young Mario here, I made it back all right. Oh, is that thing locked? Let me open it up for you. Oh, thank goodness you have a key on you. Oompa, where have you been? I looked outside and, wow, both of you in the veranda were just plain gone. Goomba, I was very, very worried about you. Really worried. Sorry, kids, I apologize. I didn't mean to make you fret. You just take it easy now. I'm back safe and sound. Everything's okay. Now, before I forget, I've decided to give you something, Mario. Wait here a minute. You always seem to beat up your enemies. Do you work out? I study self-defense by reading books by the masters and listening to Dad and Goompa. And I also exercise every day so I can be strong like you. It's starting to show, too. I'm getting big muscles. Yeah, Goombario's head is hard as a rock now. See he? When he does his head, bank move, head bonk move, it really, really hurts. Oh, be quiet, Goombaria. You're embarrassing me. Of course it is true. Sorry to have you kept you waiting, Mario. It's okay, Goomba. We're just rapping with Mario. Oh, rapping? Huh? Sorry. I wanted to give you this to Mario. The Power Jump Badge. Mario stumps on a single enemy using a lot of t attack power. This is called a badge. If you wear this, you'll be able to do a power jump, which means you'll be able to do a lot more damage with your jump attack. But listen here, and listen well. You'll only be able to do it if you're wearing the badge. You'd better try it first. Putting badges on and taking them off is a vital skill. Would you like a quick lesson in how to use badges you collect during your travels? Yes, I would, actually. Okay, then press start. The menu will open. Okay. So I do that. And then I go to... Oh. Putting on and taking out badges. Use a control stick to point at the... Okay, this. Press the A button to enter the badges screen. Press the A button again to go to the list of all the badges. Wearing badges often takes badge points. This one takes one badge point. The badge is on now. Press the A button again to take it off. The badge is now off and one BP is returned to your total. Okay. Now remember, you need FP, flower points, to use this power jump technique. Do you remember that we saw a block like this on the way back to the village? Well, these blocks will restore not only HP, but also FP. They're lifesavers, Mario. Use them whenever your HP and FP reserves are getting low. By the way, Mario... By the by, Mario, I heard from Guma. You're taking it upon yourself to try to rescue the princess from Bowser's clutches. Oh, yeah! Mario can beat Bowser with one hand tied behind his back. Hush now, Goombario. Mario, please take this hammer. It should serve you well. If I were you... If I were just a bit younger, I'd accompany you on your trip. I'd have done the damage. I'd have done damage. The earths have started to weigh on me, though. I tell you, this lower back pain. Adventure? You're so lucky! Princess rescuing is so cool! I really want to be an adventurer, too, someday. Me, too. Oh, here's an idea. Goombario. Perhaps the timing is perfect. You are no longer a child, and evil times are upon us. I'm sure Mario will agree. You should accompany Mario. What? Really? May I go, Goomba? May I really go? Yes! Oh, yeah! Mario, you won't regret this. Goombario joined your party! Press down to have him tell you about people, places, or things nearby. When you're interested, just ask him. Goombario is also helpful during battles. He can attack with head bonk, or he can tell you about an enemy's features and HP using his tattle ability. Oh, we'll be using that a lot. Way to go, Goombario! Mario, I know Goombario will prove to be a worthy companion. Well, I think it's about time for my nap. I'll be in the house. Goodbyes, have a way of making this old Goomba get weaky. Weaky? <laughs> weaky. Weepy. This is so cool, Mario. Let's go. But wait, your HP looks a little low. Maybe you ought to take a rest at the Toad House. Uh, yeah, maybe I should. Oh, I'm so excited. All right, I'm going to put on that badge because that's going to be very important for us. So I'm going to go ahead and equip that. Yeah, we're going to take a little bit of a rest here, I think. Can I sleep? How do I sleep? Do I stand on the bed? How do I... Hello? Die house slogan is refresh your body and mind. Anytime you feel tired, a good rest will fix you right up. 
Would you like to stay? Oh, yes, I would. Make yourself comfortable and enjoy your stay. Ah, uh, let's take a nap. Did you sleep well? Take care now. All right, we are feeling refreshed and ready to go. Awesome. Yes, I would like to save. All right, well, I think... Oh, you know what? I'm going to break this first. There we go. Problem solved. I have a feeling your road will be lined with difficulties, so try not to overdo it. Be watchful, yet stay cool. A calm mind is the wisest. All right, you know what? We're going to continue onward. What's this? Beware of Goombas. Oh! <laughs> oh, that's cool. Oh, I tripped. Hey, Mario. During a battle, you can change the order we attack with Z. Attack first if you want. I don't mind at all. Just keep it in mind, okay? Sounds good. What did I have a Z? Oh, here we go. Uh, abilities. Battle. This is a Goomba. Goombas are what you call small fries. Actually, they're pretty much the smallest fries. Hey, wait, I'm one of them. Max HP, max HP 2, attack power 1, defense power 0. You can jump on them or whack them with a hammer. These guys are old school. They've been around since you were in Super Mario Brothers. Oh, I like that. Alright, I'm gonna... Oh, wait, oop. Oh, wait, I wanted to test out the... Oh, yeah, here we go. I mean, I'll take flower points, but I just want to try it out. Yeah! Look at that. Yay! Awesome. Oh, I wanted to do the first hit. Oh, well, that's fine. Oh, there's two of them this time. Alright, we're gonna do a jump. Just like that. And you are gonna do a head bonk. Oh! Okay. I am now back. <laughs> that uh, took a little bit for me to fix the problem that was happening that was popping up because I had to download a whole different version of Project 64 in order for this to work. <laughs> so, um, but we're back and we can actually continue now. Um, so, because apparently, like, the other version I was playing this on, it doesn't mesh well or doesn't work well with Windows 11, so I had to get, like, I guess an updated version of that. And, um, so far it's working really well, so I don't think we're going to run into that issue anymore. Hopefully not. Um, but the good news is that... Oh, you know what? I forgot to tattle the Paragoomba. Because mm. if I tattle, it's just a regular Goomba. Yeah. Whenever we come across another Paragoomba, I'll tattle them. But, here we go! Alright. Everything's okay, though. We're A-OK! -okay. Alright, where are we? Oh, hello. Oh yeah, I should tattle this guy, too. Let's see. Tattle. Spiked Goomba. This is a Spiked Goomba. Spiked Goombas are Goombas with spikes on their heads. Magic, magic, bleh, I can't read today. Max HP 2, attack power 2, defense power 0. Whatever you do, don't jump on their spikes or you'll get hurt or even paralyzed. Yeah, we don't want that to happen. Alright, get rid of this guy first. Go away. Alright, and we also got a mushroom, which the mushroom gives us health, I believe? Yeah. That's what I'm that's what I'm assuming. We're getting much closer to our first level up as well, so that's really good. What's this? Oh! You got the Close Call Badge. When Mario's in danger, enemies sometimes fail to attack. Oh, that's cool. Eat a mushroom to regain your energy. When HP gets low, eat a mushroom with... Oh, I was right. Hey, we got another mushroom. Nice. Right, here's a Paragoomba. Oh, there's three of them in this battle. Ooh. Alright, I want you to tattle... No, I did it. <laughs> Not the freaking... Oh my gosh. Not the regular Goomba. Give her this regular Goomba. That's not what I meant to do. My bad. <laughs> oh no. Here, dump on this one. Lower his health. Alright. Paddle this one, the Paragoomba. This is a Paragoomba. Obviously, Paragoombas are Goombas with wings. Max HP 2, attack power 1, defense power 0. You can't hit them with the hammer while they're airborne. 
If you damage them, they'll fall to the ground and become ordinary Goombas. That's true. We're taking a lot of damage just for this. That's the problem with the Tattle, because it uses up a turn, so... But we'll be fine. We'll be okay. I'll just eat a mushroom after we do this battle here, or unless I find a block that I that can give me more health. It's okay, Mario. Everything's okay. Nine star point. Alright, is there a thing? Yes, there is. Beautiful. Yay! Thank you. Alright, this just goes on forever. Hey, hey! Hold it right there! You! Yeah, you suspicious guy! Don't move! Oh! Aha! You're Mario! I knew it! You can't go past here, Mr. Big Shot! It's a direct order from the Goomba King! That's right! I'm sorry, but the only way by is through the Goomba Bros. That's me, Red Goomba, and my brother, Blue Goomba. Let's get a Blue Goomba! Oh yeah! Let's do it, my Red Brother! Uh-oh. Is this another boss fight? Well, not really a boss fight. Another boss fight, but... Here we go! Big battle! Oh, I want to tattle them. Red Goomba. This is Red Goomba. He's the older of the two notorious Goomba bros. Max HP 7, attack power 1, defense power 0. The Goomba King ordered him to try to stop you. You can take this guy, no prop. He has just a little more HP than an ordinary Goomba. Mario, how'd you like some of this? Ow. Ow. Alright, well. Oh, can I not attack? I can only attack Blue Goomba. Oh, that sucks. Alright, well, fine. Take that. And then I want to tattle Blue Goomba. This is Blue Goomba. He's the younger of the two notorious Goomba bros. Match XP 6, attack power 1, defense power 0. As you heard in his little speech, he is one of the Goomba King's men. He doesn't look that healthy, he is weaker than his brother. Wow, that's- <laughs> it doesn't look healthy. Ow. Stop it. Alright, now I can attack with Goombario. Ow. Ooh. Okay, I'm gonna switch first. There you go. I'll be able to take a couple more hits, so we'll be fine. There goes Blue Goomba! Blue! Blue Goomba! Oh, my little brother! You'll pay for that, Mario! Ow. Alright, let's use our... let's see. Items? No. Wait, can I not use my special ability? I guess not. That's okay. Take that. Ow. Alright, let me eat a mushroom. There we go. 5 HP. Alright, then... Do that. Oh! We're fine. Everything is okay. I can't wait to be able to do more damage with, like, our hammer and all that, so... Oh! One more! One more HP. And we got him. Goodbye. Yeah. Ooh, 17 points away from leveling up. Yeah! I, I let you go for now. Ah, uh, so that's not the last of them. We're gonna be seeing them later. Oh, there's a save here. Cool. Yes. I think it's a good point to end the episode here, guys. In the next one, we're going to continue onward here and see what's in store for us. Because even though the red and blue Goomba retreated, the Goomba bros retreated, um, we're going to see where they went and see if we're going to be facing them again. Which I'm sure we will. I don't know how soon, but we'll see what... It what exactly happens but i'm having a really fun time playing this game and i hope you guys are enjoying watching it as well but 
If you did enjoy this, be sure to leave a like if you haven't already, and don't forget to hit subscribe as well because that lets me know that you guys enjoy the content on the channel and would like to see more. I'd like to give a shout out to my friends Gabe and Barry Medley for being members of the channel, and you could become a member too by hitting the join button down below. I've been Savvy, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye guys! See you later.